All right, today we're here with a couple of your Gator Made salesmen, Zach Pointer on the board and Alex Gibson. What we'd like to explain today is when you call into Gator Made to purchase a trailer, one of our sales professionals are going to speak to you and ask you a couple leading questions right out of the gate. One of those questions is going to be, what are you hauling and how much does it weigh? The reason they're asking you this is to find out the trailer that has the correct gross vehicle weight rating or GVWR. Alex, we have a couple examples here on the board. The first one's a John Deere. If you'd like to go through this example with us and show us what trailer you need for that weight and explain that to the customer, please. Sure, be happy to. So first, I think we need to understand what GVWR is. Gross vehicle weight rating is assigned to each trailer, and that, that number is what the trailer can haul, including its own weight. So many times we have customers call in and they they have a 10,000 pound or near 10,000 pound piece of machinery to haul, such as the example on the board, and they, they're asking about a 10K trailer. And what, what we try to do as salespeople is guide you toward the trailer that's going to do that job correctly for you. So let's look at the two examples on the board uh, with our piece of John Deere equipment weighing in at 9,900 pounds. So we may look at possibly a GTXT equipment trailer. Uh, that will have a 10,000 pound GVWR. Uh, the GTXT weighs approximately 2,000 pounds empty, leaving you with an 8,000 pound payload capacity. So not quite enough legal payload to do the job for the customer correctly and safely. So your Gatormade salesperson would rather step you up to one of our plus three series equipment trailers that are equipped with 7,000 pound axles giving a 14,000 pound GVWR. They have an approximate dry weight of 3,000 pounds, leaving an 11,000 pound legal payload. So it's going to more than carry the implement that the customer has, do it well for them, and do it safely. And that's why we ask those questions to guide the customer toward the product that's going to serve them the best. That's what we want to do. Hmm. Thank you, Alex. So then as a second example, I'd like to go over a common weight of some of the heavier equipment that people call in is with something that weighs around 20,000 pounds. Okay. Then, let's give Zach here a second to catch okay. up with us on the board. So with a larger payload, let's use a gooseneck trailer as mm -hmm. an example uh, for us. So, so let's put up two goosenecks trailers, Zach. Let's do our 20K Elite gooseneck trailer, which is a tandem axle gooseneck, versus our 24.9K dual tandem Elite gooseneck. Now one thing is coming into play on these trailer ratings. Uh, and that is weight transfer. With a gooseneck trailer, we are allowed to rate the trailer GVWR, including the amount that's going to transfer from trailer to truck. That can be up to 25%. So that is how you go from a trailer that is equipped with, say, two 10,000 pound axles, as the dual tandem is here, that's how we arrive at a 24,900 pound GVWR. So your customer is carrying Let's say in this case, let's say he's carrying 15,000 pounds to make, make the math work out. So a 20K Elite four-tire gooseneck, uh, let's use a 20 plus 5 length for this example. Write that down for us. It's going to weigh approximately 6,000 pounds. Mm -hmm. Whereas a 20 plus 5 dual tandem uh, gooseneck is going to weigh approximately 7,500 pounds. So... With a piece of equipment we're needing to haul, or the customer's requesting to haul, weighing in at 15, uh, your gator made salesman will guide them toward the dual tandem to give them the legal payload they need to do it and do it well. Your 20K Elite trailer is going to allow you to carry basically 14,000 pounds uh, mm -hmm. legally, so it's going to come in just a little shy for that equipment because the weight transfer is calculated into that number. Um, and if we look at the dual tandem trailer, it is going to give you the higher legal payload that you need to carry 15,000 pounds and carry it with ease. And it's very easy for someone who doesn't understand the law, the way it's written and the way these ratings work. Mm -hmm. If you called in and didn't know and you say, I need to haul 15,000 pounds, you would see a 16K or 20K trailer and go, mm -hmm. well, that'll be sufficient. Absolutely. And I would have, that would be my first first guess too, mm -hmm. until I started working in trailers. Mm -hmm. and you, Once and you get someone in the industry, you understand that. Yeah. yeah, I didn't understand that either before mm -hmm. I was in the industry. So what we was trying to explain here for people, and so you can see it written out there, is that your gator salesman is trying to get you into the correct trailer that, like you said, will do it safely, 
legally and perform over a long period of time. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. For you. Let's see, we zoom in here on the board a little bit so we can see here so people can take a look at that for a second. But it would be very easy for people to see that 15,000 and think, okay, well that 20K would be plenty for me when after you have it explained out here, that's not exactly what you need. And your Gatormade salesman will take you through your individual piece of equipment and get you the one you need. We just want to do a quick example here and show you this is how it's done and this is why the Gator salesman will ask you that. Thank you for taking the time to watch the video. We appreciate your business.